Hi, this is Danielle Whitney Moore, and welcome to our Team Whitney Talk this week on VA loans, which are lower down payment loan products for veterans. Many of our buyers ask us about using these loan programs for a purchase, and several of our sellers also ask us about these loan products, especially when they are considering accepting a VA buyer's offer for their property. As a seller, it is beneficial to work with VA buyers, as they tend to pay premium prices for properties since they have a lower down payment and usually need to compete with higher down payment or all cash buyers. Allowing VA buyers to submit an offer on a property will typically net a seller more money from the sale. VA buyers can purchase many types of properties, including some short sales and bank-owned properties. A buyer using a VA loan program or veterans loan program typically puts $0 down. This year, the VA loan limit in Los Angeles County for $0 down for a single family home, condo, or townhome is $726,525. The limits are also $930,300 for a duplex, $1,124,475 for a triplex, and $1,397,400 for a four unit property. If a VA buyer makes a purchase above the loan limits, then they need to put down 25% of the difference between the purchase price and the loan limit. For example, let's say a VA buyer is purchasing a single family home for $800,000. The VA buyer's down payment will be 25% of the difference between $800,000 and $726,525. The difference between $800,000 and $726,525 is $73,475. 25% of that number is $18,368.75, which would be the required down payment. A VA buyer will need funds for closing costs for their escrow fees, lender fees, title fees, etc. Our team's fee comes from the seller 99% of the time in a transaction, so normally it does not cost a buyer any money to hire an outstanding real estate team to represent them. For this loan program, our team usually estimates closing costs for a VA buyer at 3% of the purchase price. This figure is normally on the higher side. For example, on a $700,000 property, a buyer using this program will need about $21,000 for closing costs, but wait. If a VA buyer does not have $21,000 available, we can ask the seller for a credit for the buyer's closing costs, so the buyer comes out of pocket essentially $0 for the transaction. Yes, I said $0. For VA loans, a termite report is required. The VA buyer cannot pay for the termite report, so we normally request for the seller to pay for that cost in our initial offer. The VA buyer can, however, pay for the cost of termite repairs, so these costs are up to negotiation between the buyer and the seller. To use a VA loan, the property needs to be in livable condition since the buyer is putting no money down as long as the loan amount is under the current loan limits. An appraiser will call out issues such as chipping and peeling paint, missing fixtures such as toilets, sinks, etc., missing outlet switches, missing flooring, missing smoke detectors or carbon monoxide detectors, etc. A home can be in older condition and still be considered livable. Any items an appraiser calls out need to be corrected before the buyer's lender will allow a loan on the property. These items can be fixed by the seller, the buyer, or a combination thereof. VA appraisers take significantly longer than appraisers for other loan products, so our team will normally instruct for the appraisal to be ordered on day one of a transaction. A VA appraisal can take up to 14 days to receive back, and normally a VA buyer only has 17 days to complete the appraisal in a transaction. If you are purchasing a condo or townhome utilizing a VA product, the condo complex will need to be approved by VA. The great thing about VA complex approvals is that they never expire, so if the complex has been approved at any time in the past by VA, we can proceed as normal. If the complex you choose is not approved, our lender's team will work on the VA complex approval for our team at no charge to the buyer, seller, or complex. Team Whitney is very experienced with VA loan products, so whether you are a seller or a buyer, we will be here to help navigate you through this intricate loan process. Thank you for joining me on this Team Whitney Talk. See you next time.